Let's move on to multi-platforming. Yeah. Wombats, Overwatch, Onslaught. And news and stuff. I played with a new hero in Overwatch, Brigitte. Or Brigitte? Brigitte? Brigitte. So, Br- Brigitte, I think it's pronounced. Brigitte. Troll called Brigitte. Brigitte Nielsen? I don't know. Oh, does that I'd mean they're going to she- add Flavor Flav? No, they're not. Are they she adding? Seemed- are they going to add Flavor Flav? <laughs> Dude, this no. just in. Flavor Flav coming to Overwatch. That's why it's called Overwatch, because he wears a giant clock. That's how you know when it's over for Overwatch, is that they start importing like celebrity characters. Flavor Flav! And then he stops time. He's he's really not in the public eye anymore, I don't think. That's why it wouldn't be the end of the game. Because people would be like, oh, this is a great, crazy original character. I think you would see like King Kim Kardashian. Kardashian. Kardashian? Sure. Or Kardashian. Kardashian? Kardashian. You'd see someone like that before you see uh, Flavor Flav. Hmm. Where are we, Wombat? We're talking about you played with the new character in Overwatch. Any good? <laughs> I don't know. She got a shield and a mace. Seemed all right. I it's have hard both to of get those to play things. to play. It's, seem it's like hard. A big deal. What's that? I said I have both those things. It doesn't seem like a big deal. You have a shield and a mace. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> well, why? <laughs> None of your business. <laughs> <laughs> Kazoo. <laughs> um. She seemed fine. I don't know. It's hard to get to play as her because everybody wants to play as her. And, you know, only one person can take her in the round. So it's basically the first person who can navigate over to her and hit A. And I'm not that quick. Gotcha. Uh, did you see this Star Wars Battlefront 2 news? Yeah, I checked it out today. Oh, okay. I wanted to see what the update looked like. So I loaded oh, cool. that game up. Oh, I'm curious to hear about it. All right. Um, when I loaded it up, I had seven crates to open. So that was kind of... <laughs> surprising I'm like oh wow you, seven crates so i opened up my crates and they just you had will to open eat. the crates the, so you don't get the 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 cards anymore in crates you only get like emotes and credits although i don't know what credits are used for because now every hero is unlocked and it wasn't letting me buy any new crates at this time so i think they're sort of like in some weird gray area period where they don't know what they're doing kind of like when the game launched I guess it's wow. cool that every hero is unlocked, but now to get cards, you have to get, like, you get them through gameplay, but even when you have the card available, you still need, like, a token or something to unlock the card. You need to be a certain level, I think, to You can't just get some of the high-level abilities just starting out by... You have to actually progress, I think. Yeah, but game. you still need to do... You, but that unlocks the ability to get the card. It doesn't unlock the card. Oh, I'm already getting tired just thinking about it. it I, was, I was actually kind of confused, and I'm not sure if this is better. I mean, I guess it's cool that every hero is unlocked, but I think at this point, most people playing the game probably already had every hero unlocked. So it doesn't... You know, I, I guess it's a way to... I, I maybe they're just trying to get people to buy this game. I don't know. I never finished the campaign in it, which I guess is a whole other thing. I didn't, to, yeah, I, I sort of. I you know I just don't like the way the game feels when you play it. Like it just doesn't. There's a there's definitely a, a weird sort of like a clunkiness to it that could be yeah. better. But yeah, I even talk, I'm just talking about the single player. Yeah, I know what you're talking. I'm yeah, not I'm not disagreeing with you. There's there's something to it. It's not. Maybe on PC it has a different. It probably has a totally different feel, but. I don't know. I don't know uh, I'm not. I'm not uh, disagreeing with you. Okay. But uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what they're they're trying. They're trying. They're trying to get people to come back. Yeah. I, it may be. Too, it may be too late. Yeah. I mean, you know, when you would you design a game around maximizing it, what you think could will maximize it in terms of you know microtransaction revenue. It's not the best way, probably, to design a progression system or a multiplayer mode, and you don't. And you know what? It's it's even hard to predict what will bring in the most money. You know, sometimes just going a simple route is the is the will bring in the most money. You don't need to like make something overly complicated. I have a coworker that's playing one of those free to play iPad build the castle games. Okay. And I asked him how much money he spent on it so far. Oh, 50 bucks. $150. Wow. 
<laughs> on one free to play iPad. How does game. he feel about that? He's perfectly happy with it. It's his He's favorite fine. game. He loves okay. it. It's he. I mean, like, don't get wrong. He's you know he has no kids and he's single and he's has and he makes it. You know he does well for himself. It's not like sure. if he if that's what he likes to do to enjoy himself with. He works very hard. I, yeah, it's no, it's perfectly funny. fine. It just it's like really a hundred and fifty bucks yeah, on yeah, the, yeah. So it made me laugh. Yeah. 